Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Be on the West Coast, down in New Orleans or whatever. So, man, it's a big deal for me for y'all to even be on this show, man. Appreciate you know that, what I'm man. saying? Like, that. like Propane, when he hit me up, I'm like, who? He like, yeah, you gotta do them. You don't even know. That's like, how I'm bro, bro. It's like, That's damn, cool. for real. Pro man, I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm, I'm like, damn, these boys heavy. It's more than Pro that to probably say that about us, though. Wow. Not to even talk he like pro, that. Pro is the one that's yeah. like, man, y'all too, man, y'all got too yeah. much going on. I hear from Pro. About this shit, man. All he right. be mad at us. All right, so how I was saying earlier, we don't do interviews, we don't really do podcasts. I don't say we don't do them, it's just, it's pulling teeth. When you don't have PRs yeah. and managers and nobody's reaching out yeah. to us. I like that. Y'all like, like me. Yeah, yeah. Like, like you make your own decisions. Yeah, 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 that's yeah, all yeah. you we say. We just go, we go, it's work. And then, and then even when we look at our, in our, our catalog, lots of times people say, man, how do you feel about this? It's like, bro, it's just work. That was another day of work. Us. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. So yeah. we do this every day. It's it's stuff that's gonna come out next year that we probably thought nothing of. It was just that was last night. You at the studio. thinking it's not interesting to tell your story? That's what you that, think. I think yeah. oh, you and, hit it, and it's hard too. But the crack story crack. hard. You though. know how many people have told me that they were like, "Bro, people want to hear that shit." That's and right. Me, you know, people just say, "How was your day at work?" I don't talk about that shit. <laughs> some niggas and some backwoods road. We made some music. But again, my thing is definitely the fact that and these are classic nights. That's right. right. We don't realize they're classic nights. To some three of years the stuff later. y'all ain't telling me right now that not happen in that oh, studio. A lot, a lot of stuff. You can some stuff you can't we talk about. about. Some stuff you can. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, some stuff you be like, damn. That was a hell of a night, but to you, you just like you, 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 you really ain't tapped into it like that because to you it was a hell of a night, but you like to somebody else it might be nothing. You know what I'm saying? We but talked about this the other day, like how we don't do interviews and stuff, and we never really got our story out there because nobody has brought it out of us. Anytime we do interviews, they don't ask the right questions. Well, yeah. so we know we we. That's why I was like, I don't like doing interviews. They don't really ask the right stuff. I yeah. think somebody I, has to ask you to do it. To ask you, but to I get think out. I think the, the thing is, you gotta understand they gotta know your world too a lot of yeah. time. But also the way we do it is more open format. Yeah, so just it just talking. it just yeah, pops yeah, out. Yeah, 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 it just pops out. I think I was as dope, but right, yeah. because nah, of that, I like this. I don't we, know, we just this talking. is way better than a lot of the interviews we have done because they ask the question is like. Nah, they too serious. That wouldn't. Yeah. Even, I don't give a damn. It's the truth. Nah, we had. What did I, I, mean, say? I like? I love the culture. This is for the culture yeah. for me. Now, what you were about to say? I cut the hell. No, I was saying. No, no, you good. I was saying that we um we love what we do, and like I say, it's going to work every day. So I, that's like asking a, a lawyer, "How was it at work today? How was it in court today?" And he's like, "Man." Pour me a drink, bro. Like, I'm like <laughs> let's go play pool. Like, you don't want to talk. Now I don't say you want to talk about it, but it's work. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, but yeah. it's not work where it's like I hate going to work. You know, you love going to work, but everybody don't got a job. But like you say, we'll have a classic night on Tuesday, and here comes Thursday. There's another one. Yeah. And Friday, there's yeah. another one because they still in you town. Probably have one tonight. Yeah. Right. And we uh -huh. don't really know. We don't really. It's just work to us. And then later on, talking about it on the podcast, you go. Man, we had a time last. <laughs> time, that, like, like, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, like it, it, it be like that. So a lot of time, and nothing's really planned. You know, a lot of people, you know, nothing's really planned, especially sessions. You know, a lot of times the best sessions are the one where, hey, uh, let's give a little Jeremy or something. And we just think it's little Jeremy tonight. Wow. But such and such is in town. Such and such is in the town. Such and such, and they all like little Jeremy, so they're calling him. Well, we're coming to wherever you are. Yeah. I'm at GNB, and they come here, oh, and now man. we got this nigga in the studio, that nigga in the studio, this nigga. They in the try studio, to come up with something to do a track. Yeah, and it's like, damn, nigga, what's the name of here? What's the name of here? I'm gonna feel like my starstruck moment was Boosie, though. What it was? Why? It was Tell because me why. it was it was it was the moment that the first time we were playing a beat, and it wasn't even our beat. I think I was recording them, sitting at the what's the name. Somebody. He was off like, before you say yeah. that. The reason why he say that is because Boosie and Webby were off. Favorite, favorite rappers, period. Before, yeah, man, no, I can't we say. from Houston, Boosting Webb was our favorite. Yeah, yeah. but. Rest in peace, Pimp, I love you, bro, but goddamn, Boosting Webb was well, goddamn. Well, Pimp shit. was the reason that happened, but at the end For of sure. the day, Pimp's my favorite. Pimp was my favorite. Mine too, the nigga. Yeah. So, Mine too. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So, I, But I get it. I understand why. Because Webby and them went hard. They was time. raw, uncut. Boosie and they was like, like Savage us. Life. And when we would do early okay. interviews and they would say, who do y'all want to work with? This is before before we ever worked with them. They, who would y'all want to Most people say Jay-Z. We answered the same we time. We always say Boots and Webby. Let's go. Boots and Webby. All, all, we would always say that. Wow. But it's because we're from here. We were so close to there. That was the, oh, that's the kind of music we like. Uh, uh. It was when the first time I was recording Boosie, and he was, he was right here to the right of me. And your beat was playing and he was rapping. What he do? He rap everything and then he gives somebody his phone and he literally raps to them. 
and they write it that you be on your shit. You know oh, what I'm saying? Whatever. Shit. He, do do that. he gonna yeah. do that. He gonna be like, uh, uh. He he gonna gonna turn around, start rapping. Somebody's supposed to be writing it down in the notes. You gotta start rapping. What he doing? That's what he do. That's how he Damn. record his verse. And I remember him rapping, and he hit he hit me on my shoulder and was like, "You like that shit? What you think?" And it was like, "You the greatest." <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that? No, no, no. you can't nigga. say that. I, I say, nigga, that shit go off. Nigga, go on the booth, nigga. I put my gangsta shit on inside. You the fucking greatest booth. <laughs> <laughs> no, because you love you. you have, Man, like I had times listening to booths. Yeah, any any ex girlfriend I had in high school, a little bit after high school, knew like bitch, we jamming booths. I mean, excuse you know, excuse me, black lady, like, like, girl, we playing booths and Webby. That we we riding around vibing, we jamming booths and Webby. That, yeah. that was my thing. They had songs to me. Well, you went that cheap route to do that deck pop out. Well, here it is. It came, it was kind of like, damn, we really working with an idol of ours. Ours, and this hour, I said it by him too. Yeah, he's yeah. from Baton Rouge. What? Not bad. No, 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 no I'm sorry. Platt. Bill Platt. You Bill Platt. Bill Platt. Yeah. I didn't mean to say that. But I spent yeah, a lot Bill of time in New Orleans. Yeah, yeah. 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 That's Bill, all so he yeah. already had the culture on him of, you know, being yeah. out that way. So, and I just loved it regardless. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.